Yes, when I mentioned that word. I would too. <laughs> I am here at the uh, Pearl booth, Robin Flans Drummer Interviews, with an old, old, old friend, not in age, cool. not in age, not in age, just in time, my dear friend, Eddie Taduri. And um, Eddie, we're, we're standing in front of some special drums because really you, are. because you have a wonderful, you've started, founded, and run a wonderful um, company, organization, called the Rhythmic Arts Project. And I want you to tell, just a, give me a, just a little taste about it and tell me about these drums. Well, um, the Rhythmic Arts Project obviously is a, uh, a program that teaches reading, writing, and arithmetic, social skills, and creative thinking, and there's over a hundred different exercises uh, for people with uh, intellectual and developmental differences. So I work with people with Down syndrome and autism uh, and every other uh, condition, uh, as well as typical children. In South America, we just wrote a book for typical children in, in cooperation with the American International School. I've been working in Quito for about eight years now. And we're in 14 countries all together. Pearl, uh, just to, to cut to this, uh, Pearl has been with me for many years uh, in, in different respects. Like they've always helped me with manufacturing. I get all my drums made through Pearl, all my percussion items. And uh, just this year, they called me about four months ago and they said, would you mind very much if we donate a portion of our new line to the Rhythmic Arts Project. You know? Oh yeah, I would mind. Wait a minute, like, t twist my arm, you know. So today is my first day at the show, and, and naturally I walked in, I, I thought, well there's gonna be about four drums, you know, four little, you know, and I came in and I noticed, oh my God, there's like 19 or 20 different uh, djembes of all sorts of uh, sizes and shapes and, is the line called something? What's the line called? Sure, I swear, I, I don't know what it is. We also, have not, we also have these rain sticks, which are very beautiful. That's part of the, uh, a portion of everything they sell here will go to the Rhythmic Arts Project. So, you know, I mean, whatever that is, I'm just, I'm eternally grateful. Pearl's always been so nice to me. They've never, they've never been, you know, I, I play the I play Pearl drums, which they they made me a beautiful set uh, last year that I, I love. I got I mean, I'm I'm just grateful. I'm very grateful. You know, we can talk more about the program. At, at yes, a and we are going to. Eddie uh, has agreed, thankfully, to be on my uh, radio show, Robin Flan's Drummer Interviews. And with that, every 20 years or so, we do we get together. And <laughs> we do, and I, I don't even want to say when the last time I saw Eddie was, and the time before that, I won't, I, it, yes, you remember. The first one, when I, was, when I woke up from that operation, I was only there a day or so, and I woke up, I, I opened my eyes, and there was you and Vinny sitting on my bed. So, and we'll talk about that, too. So, uh, with that, and that's a little teaser for our interview at Robin Flans Drummer Interviews. Eddie's going to be on the radio show coming up real soon. <laughs>